Hi guys, it's me Beata from horoscopesandreadings.com and welcome to today's video. Today I decided uh, to make a tarot video, pick a card video about what will happen in this connection. So uh, for those who are new here, hi, hello and welcome. If you like it here, please hit the subscribe button because I will make these tarot pick a card uh, videos on a regular basis now. So in case you are tarot lover and you really want to know more about you and your person and your relationship then you are at the right place here so uh, as usually we have three groups here i have actually um, plenty of new tarot decks so i will try to use uh, some of them in this video okay so you will enjoy also cards so here we go this is uh, number one group number one you know these cards are randomly <coughs> really picked but we have two of cups here as you can see this is rose cards you are my group number two lovers and this blue heart is a page of wands you know so please take your time make your selection and uh, see you at your pile so guys here i am and here i go with your reading so um in today's pick a card i'm going to look at what is going to happen in your connection so obviously uh, this video is for those uh, who have your specific person or your partner or your ex-partner in your mind and you really want to know what will happen in your connection next okay uh, so uh, before i start i would like to tell you that of course i offer a private uh, pick a card uh, or not pick a card really but private uh, readings uh, where you can ask me up to five questions and uh, it's going to be delivered uh, to your mailbox directly via video recording okay uh, the way how you can order your private reading is listed in the description below this video so we can start we can start uh, with your question number one question what will happen in this connection and uh, of course i would like to have some energy background check what is going on in your connection and then what will happen in this connection with your person so well i would like to adjust my camera first okay so straight off the bat what i see here we have plenty of pentacles pentacles is always a slow moving energy but it is really one of uh, you know we need pentacles we need pentacles in case we really want to thrive in our relationship or to really make some progress in our relationship we need pentacles but let me uh, put all the cards on the desk uh, first and then i will tell you what is going to happen in your connection next okay i have queen of swords we have full right now i would like to get some of these okay get more information mm -hmm. and i also have my lenormand cards these are very effective so this is paradise clog is sticking okay okay so so maybe i will i will do more cards if i need to clarify in a minute but let's get started with your reading so what i see here already now what is happening currently in your situation in your connection is um we have ten of one seven of cups etc this, this looks like a separation this looks like you know uh things are a little bit heavy or heavier 
and also there is some clouded vision of the relationship so probably you really don't know where you stand uh, with your person or with your relationship in general and maybe even this is the reason why you watch uh, some of these uh, videos definitely someone is here in the cold so it, it, it really looks like separation to me it's like probably uh, things were not moving uh, as fast as you would like them to see and that is the reason why there is at least a stagnation in this situation but in my opinion um, this connection became burden at least for you you know it's her really who is carrying the burden in this card so in case you are a woman you may perceive this connection to be a burden and uh, and you know it's like almost unbearable right um so probably and may also be no contact or very limited contact in this situation and it looks like you are not on the same page with your person currently, right? These are current energies of what is going on in your connection right now. So um, the question is, what is going to happen next? Well, I will say with this Hermit uh, card, uh, maybe uh, there will be uh, at least, you know, a couple of, let's say like two weeks still, some sort of silence between both of you but let me tell you this hermit per period is very important because uh, when we are in this hermit mode we really search deeper through or even like you know the more meaningful answers to big questions when it comes to our relationship so this may very well be your person uh, who will be in this mode at least for a couple of weeks still then but you know things will uh, start moving eventually because what i see here with this beautiful knight of cups and page of swords definitely this person is going to reach out to you with some romantic gesture or with some romantic offer okay well you know mm, with this knight of cups energy uh, this can look like uh, this person will flatter your looks this person will will actually uh, tell you something you know meaningful but but this will come from the bottom of his heart you know because le let's remember that uh, he is now currently and will be for some time in a deep introspection about his feelings about what this connection really means to him and then he will come up uh, come out of his shell and and tell you these words directly okay now once these let's say sweet words or beautiful words are spoken it is going to uh, feel very uh, you know there will be a lot of peace in this connection afterwards in my opinion these words can actually bring you uh, some sort of um, even uh, healing right it's like maybe maybe you expected him to tell you some uh, th these words or you know this can uh, this can very well be um apology coming your way uh, from this person okay um and maybe this is going to be start you know a start of new chapter uh, in this connection because you are here uh, represented as this queen of swords energy you know swords energy or, or or swords in general are quite cold energy or at least it looks like that even though this person may actually tell you how they feel or you know apologize for their uh, previous actions you will still be you know a little bit let's say colder towards them even though with that fool you will be inclined to really think about new beginning because what i see here really is that this person is coming uh, with good intentions towards you and will be and he will be really ready to make a move right uh, to make a move towards you now 
you have advice here uh, from angels uh, uh, tarot decks get more information and in my opinion you being here as queen of swords this is what you're gonna do right you will really uh, try to seek more information you know about this person about this connection if you can really trust uh, him or her again but you all definitely take your time which is completely okay now with lenormand cards uh, we have similar cards actually about about searching about really you know exploring uh, his offer if it's good enough if it is trustworthy etc so you will definitely um, take your time to really assess his offer properly right let me grab more cards okay hard with a key welcoming love meeting the one open your heart getting together perfect so this is him right this is him he's going to come uh, with an offer and let me tell you this is definitely within uh, three months okay from the time you watch this video this person is going to reveal how he feels what else clock need time takes time in time cycles time to heal progress yes uh, things are getting into alignment and this person will progress but what we see with, with clock also we have the theme of clock twice here in your reading uh, you know um, this situation needed uh, some time to develop so so this was what i actually told you at the beginning that uh, here uh, we probably had some sort of you know period of stagnation in this connection photograph wow so this person is right now or at the time you really watch this reading looking at your photos missing your nostalgia so yeah if this person has your uh, phot photos uh, pictures of you or you know is able to see some of your stuff on the internet he's definitely watching you on the internet or you know watching uh, your pictures and contemplating about them okay guys so this was your reading thank you very much for watching don't forget to hit the subscribe button because next week i'll be back with more pick a card videos on my channel modern astrology so don't miss out thank you very much and now i'm going to move to the group number two hello hello this is going to be reading for everyone who chose these rose cords you know rose cord is really stone of love okay and this is going to be love reading of course because now i'm going to look at the energies uh, surrounding your connection and you know there's going to be main question about what is going to happen in your connection this is going to be like three months a forecast a three months prediction of upcoming events in your connection if you are new here i would like to welcome you and if you like it here please hit the subscribe button because uh, i decided that i am going to upload these pick a cards regularly like on a weekly basis so you are definitely very welcome here also i am available for private readings i can actually um uh, or you can actually ask up to five questions and your reading will be video recorded i will send it to you directly and everything including my prices is listed in the description below this video so if you are interested please check it out i have you know uh currently i have 14 years experiences with tarot and also with astrology as well so let's do this what is going to happen in this connection it's the main question but firstly i would like to ask cards what is going on right now between both of you okay so you can actually 
you can actually decide whether this is your pile or no. Ten of Cups, King of Swords. Okay. Now, let me see. We have Two of Pentacles. Okay. Seven of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. Queen of Cups. Nice. Tower. Mm. The Empress. Judgment. Okay. Hmm. This looks like, you know, a little bit heavier connection in my opinion. But let's see. Now I am going to pull one of these angel cards in the near future. So yeah, there is definitely something happening in the near future. Okay, we have house. Now I am pulling out of these Lenormand cards. Child. Nice. Uh, okay, so let's get started. In case I need, I will clarify some of these um, in a minute. So, we are starting your reading with Queen of Swords, right? Queen of Swords is uh, someone who can be a little bit, you know, harsh uh, with her words. And it's because she has been wounded in the past, okay? It's really not about like she's a bad person or something like that, but, but she really needs to guard herself because, you know, world was, or, or not really world, but men were not treating her very well in the past. And this is the outcome here. Now, another card is magician, but see, magician has really all elements, but this... Uh, <laughs> This sword is really striking to me. So it's like probably what is currently going on is, and we have King of Swords on the top of that. Maybe you are still together. This can very well be the case, but probably some harsh words were said in this connection because so much uh, swords energy, even if, if it looks like positive energy, tells me that, that probably what could actually happen or is happening uh, there was a quite heavy really argument in this connection and you are really wondering what's up or what will be going on you know you see very persistent here uh, with your energy and uh, it's like my way or highway with this queen of swords or this is at, at least my impression of her now there is still a lot of love you know uh in this connection and you both feel it equally ten of cups is really emotional fulfillment in this connection so you love each other but maybe even if you are from the same element you are queen of swords his king of swords you you don't know how to really communicate with one another and what is really interesting here is that you are at the beginning of your spread and your king is is really the last card of the first row so it's like you may not even be communicating at this time this is what i see here now what is going to happen in the near future you as a queen of swords you will definitely go through some really really big changes in your own maybe appearance as well but in your own understanding because we have queen of cups tower and the empress you are definitely taking uh, this uh, situation into your own hands and you are really telling everyone that don't mess with me okay with the judgment there uh, there's a lot of even coming back energy past energies so definitely in the near future what can be happening in upcoming three months is really there is like this cleansing you know with tower everything or you know um you had uh, some type of partnership uh, with this person in the past but everything what you knew 
or, or, or you know the way you had your relationship or the way you have it now this is going to be destroyed with the tower card and now or, or really then you will become even more stronger more powerful and and really uh, you know like one of a kind the Empress energy and the judgment oh my goodness um, uh, this is really strong um, this is really strong now side note because the Empress is usually pregnant woman and we have child as well okay um, for for some of you you know if you are interested you can definitely get pregnant well th this can very well happen with these cards because even on the judgment card we have child as well but of course this is not going to be for everybody but in the near future in my opinion things will change drastically and dramatically you will be the empress meaning you will definitely set the tone of the relationship and it is going to be your way you know this card is actually hypnotizing me i, I really have to still observe this queen of swords because she's very determined and this is what is going to happen in your in your um near future of this relationship he will adjust we have house okay so maybe uh you will feel like you really want to move in together we have palm tree stability security growth okay so so yeah this can be the case that things will change but things will change for the better rebuilding with hammer okay what else we have the chaser codependent relationship well maybe or even if you were chasing this person this is going to end because as i told you in upcoming three months probably in two months uh, there is the tower moment which will really uh, shake up the foundation of the relationship but for the better okay so so don't be scared in case this happens because because it will change drastically your relationship for the better and your relationship will develop on your terms so however you want it because you are the empress okay okay guys so this was your reading thank you very much for watching um, if you like it here i would love to have you here so hit the subscribe button because next week i'll be back with more relationship pick a card videos have a good day bye bye hello 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 everyone who chose this blue heart and this is going to be your reading so guys i decided that i will make comeback with my pick a card readings because i know that you enjoyed this type of videos on my channel so so uh, here is a little announcement that every week i'm going to upload brand new pick a card video so if you like it here please feel free to hit the subscribe button so you will be informed you know about new uploads on my channel also i of course uh, make uh, private readings for my clients when it comes to tarot cards uh, you can ask up to five questions and and i will record your reading on video and i will send it to you how to order reading from me you can definitely read everything in the description below this video you know it's pretty simple how to really um, order um, your reading from me okay so let's get started with your with your pick a card today well i have to tell you that i would like to start off with some energies 
surrounding this connection right now so pretty much what is going on right now in your connection because only then we will get a clear picture and only you can decide if this is even your reading okay so let's see what is going on currently in your connection and then i will i will tell you what is going to happen okay so let me grab my cards we have this uh, swords energies king of cups okay the sun great perfect well two of wands right okay knight of swords nice three of cups now i'm going to pull one of my angel cards be assertive you as a queen of cups being here be assertive and now i'm going to pull some of my lenormand from my lenormand tarot deck okay labyrinth man cross so definitely uh, this relationship with the cross can be karmic may or may not be but definitely definitely very important okay every time this cross uh every time i see this cross in my readings i know that this relationship is very very important and you really and even it is very uh attaching right it is not so easy to let this person go or even to let this relationship go so i don't know about you and your experience you can definitely leave your comment below but very very important very fated connection even so let's see what is going on right now now we have in the middle of the first row we have five of swords so at least there was uh, some heavy argument between both of you we have some sort of defeat so one of you or maybe both of you feel defeated in this connection and again as uh, with the group two we are starting with one of you actually with him king of pentacles and you as a queen of cups you are you know as the last card of the first row so there is some sort of separation or distance between both of you even though your person look at this beautiful six of cups card even though your person is definitely reminiscing is definitely having a lot of thoughts memories a lot of nostalgia right and uh, he, he is really thinking heavily about you but he's not the only one because what i see here is that you are open you are open to make things work okay now uh, what is going to happen in your connection in upcoming three months mm. your king will come out of this fear because with eight of swords there is definitely a lot of fear and it's like he is not uh, seeing things clearly or he's not able or you know he is not um let's say uh, he, he doesn't have like a lot of courage to really come up to you but this is going to end you know this is really just the first card of the second row it's like eight of swords very fearful very anxious thoughts this is him right currently or even in upcoming week but things will change because he will come out of his own prison and he will go directly to you with full speed <laughs> knight of swords so he will come to you let's say in a month or so to really make you feel good because we have sun card and sun energy is always very potent sun energy is always very uh you know there is a lot of happiness joy oh uh, there is really a lot of good stuff really so in my opinion he will please you 
this is this is what is going to happen and it will not even take uh, so much time now advice for you is to be assertive so you know don't really brush it uh, under the carpet but be willing to discuss even more difficult matters of this relationship with your person this is crucial because this is actually advice this is actually advice for you to really uh, be assertive and to really uh, tell what is on your mind okay be really sincere right and you see here the sword and rose clarity through revelation so if there is something on your mind you really want to tell him even about your relationship and uh, about your situation don't be afraid to do so okay maybe you have been rejected in the past by him not dealing okay maybe he didn't want to deal with the stuff uh, of this relationship but this is this is what really caused this defeat like you or both of you feel defeated uh, by this connection in the first place so hopefully you will find your way out of this mess mm -hmm. he is waiting for you you see and last card is paradise happiness expansion joy so you will make it so congratulations you will make it but but really you know um, be willing to have this uncomfortable um uncomfortable uh, discussion with your person because this is going to help you to see things clearly and to really even help him to be more truthful or sincere to you in the future okay okay guys so this was your reading on my channel uh, thank you very much for watching once again if you like it here please hit the subscribe button you can let me know in the comments what uh, else uh, i should make a video about next because uh, as i have told you at the beginning i would like to make these picker cards every week so feel free to participate and you know suggest themes of the videos I wish you a very nice day and bye-bye.